So their definition, and again, you might have put it in your own words, is that when it comes down to it, similar figures means that we're looking at figures that have the same shape, like these two down here, the exact same shape, but not the same size. And so that's how similar is different from congruent. With congruent figures, the figures would have to be the same shape and the same size. But with similar figures, same size is not a requirement. All right, the next thing is, well, then what are corresponding angles if they're not the exact same shape? Well, with corresponding angles, it's just like before. They're the matching angles. A matches with D, B matches with E, C matches with F. And even though they're similar and not uh, congruent triangles, that it does turn out that those angles are congruent to each other. And it's a little hard to see on the screen, but that's the congruency symbol, the uh, equal sign with the little squiggle on top. So A is the same angle measure as D, B is congruent to E, C is congruent to F. Now what has changed though, since the sizes don't have to be the same, that with corresponding sides, well, corresponding sides still means matching sides, so side AB here would match with side DE, and so on and so forth. But with similar figures, they're not the same. But we do get uh, equal ratios, that if we match up the ratio, match up the sides and form ratios out of them, like AB and DE, that that ratio is equal to AC over DF. And here's what I mean. So if I take the side lengths, AB, and put it over DE, well, it turns out that that fraction, that ratio, turns out to be the same as BC and EF. And it turns out to be the same as the last one, AC over DF. And in fact, this is what we call the scale factor. It's telling us how much bigger or larger that this shape is compared to the original. All right, so the way we indicate that shapes are, are similar is with this symbol right here. It's just the little squiggle line. No equal sign, just the squiggle. So this says that triangle ABC is similar to DEF. And notice how this is different from congruent.